The trails less traveled are the ones I cherish the most, and Oregon owns a bounty of them, especially out of the way places where nature's touch restores the soul. Hi there, I'm Grant McComey, your host for Travel Oregon's Grant's Getaways, and this week we get up close with nature on a trail you've likely missed along the McKinsey River, just out of Eugene. Come on along. We're headed for Oregon's one and only Blue Pool. The timeless roadway that follows the McKinsey River cries out for your attention, especially after you take time to listen to its song. Nostalgia is alive along this byway. You feel it when you pass through two of Lane County's 20 covered bridges. Good pasture at 165 feet, Oregon's second longest, and Belknap Bridge, a river crossover since 1890. As you rise to meet the mountains, discover that you can trade in your car for hiking boots along the McKinsey River Trail. The McKinsey River Valley is made for year-round recreation, and this hiking trail is a good example of that. It's called the McKinsey River National Recreation Trail, about 26 miles long, along the river, and the best part, about half of that distance is below the annual snow line, so you have good opportunities for not only hiking and biking, but also photography. And with early spring temps topping 60 degrees, it's easy to reach the plunge pool world of Sahali and Coosa Falls along a trail that's always open. They're easy to access. Anybody can see them. And the water just comes shooting out like a fire hydrant. It's this huge, big wall of water any time of year. And then there's a great path that you can walk from Sahali down to Coosa Falls, not even five minutes from your car to the falls. It'll take a bit longer to reach Oregon's one and only Blue Pool. Two hikers brought cameras to capture the sights along the four mile out and back trail to the Blue Pool. When I go out in the woods, I go real slow. I hike slow, I look at things, I love to look at things. I pace myself for doing that. I feel like a little kid. I'm always trying to explore, always. Photo pro Steve Terrell and Oregon newcomer Roy Nuesca agree the McKinsey River provides an unmatched canvas to create lasting memories with camera and lens. Now I'm looking around here and there are, are literally thousands of photographs from reflections to the lichens, the moss. There's an array of gorgeous things up here besides the big pool. Wow. It's like, like stunning. The Blue Pool, AKA Tamalich Pool, is where the McKinsey River seeps to the surface through underground lava fields that covered the landscape eons ago. The deep turquoise and stunning clarity combine for something special. Very clear, very clean. Uh, I've never seen anything like it before. What I'm looking for here is something in the foreground that captures your interest and just captures the essence of where we're at. Terrell's been at many Oregon places in search of models to build his annual calendars. His most recent 2015 All Oregon production provides peaks into gorgeous Oregon settings, like Tim Creek in Malheur County. It's one of those peaceful shots that there's real soft snow, the colors, there's, there's subtle colors in it, and it was just one of those magical, magical days. I like that a lot. Well, I happen to notice this Oregon grape coming out, and this branch is sort of framing the pool too, so I've got some colors coming in here. You'll be astounded by the color of the blue pool, so hurry here soon, and then slow down. And savor spring's awakening in the Oregon outdoors. The hike into the Blue Pool is a real Oregon experience. Four miles out and back, the trail is gentle, but be sure you wear hiking boots and bring plenty of water. We have all the details, the directions, and the contact information so you can experience the Blue Pool right here on the Travel Oregon website. So be sure to check it out. Until next week, do get out here and explore the great Oregon outdoors. Let Travel Oregon be your guide. For Travel Oregon, I'm Grant McComey.